This is an overview of a set square and this is a 30-60 set square. So this means that it has two separate angles um, intentionally on it and a third 90 degree angle. So this angle here is 90 degrees. That's your typical square, square corner. This one is a 60 degree angle and this one is a 30 degree angle. Now, it's quite a useful tool, especially if you need to produce uh, isometric style drawings, for example. So if I was to slide my rule up, I could use the two sides. I could arrange it there and I could draw a 30 millimeter line or 30 degree line rather there. And then let's say if I was to move up, I could then flip my square over. I could draw a line in the opposite direction. I could then spin my square around, draw a vertical line. Draw another one here. And then again, using that 30 degree angle, we can come along and draw in some of these additional lines. And see very quickly, you can begin to draw uh, three dimensional shapes quite easily. Now, if you were to do something like that, again, you'd use guidelines, so you use very faint lines with the 30, uh, 60 square. This is another square, again, slightly different angles, except this is an equilateral square. Um, so we have a 45 degree angle and a 45 degree angle, and then the 90 degree angle here. So 45 degrees, 45 degrees means that this will provide you a nice clear diagonal line wherever you are. So if you draw a straight line there, and use the 45 degree angles. You can very quickly divide up the shape into clear sections. Again, 45 degree angle tool is very useful, uh, regardless of what your drawing is does tend to come in quite handy.